what happened, why the United States and Britain were so hell-bent on toppling democracy in Iran? Well, the official argument that is constantly repeated was it was to save Iran from uh, communism and the Soviet threat. In reality, when you look at the documents, there was no communist threat or Soviet interest in Iran. The main concern of the United States was that if nationalization in Iran of oil was successful, this would set a terrible example to other countries where U.S. oil interests were uh, present, countries such as Kuwait, uh, Saudi Arabia, Venezuela, Indonesia. So the, the, the nightmare in Washington was that if you have a successful nationalization in Iran, this would be a contagious disease that would spread throughout the world, and this would change the whole balance of power. Uh, and this was really the main interest. But, of course, American politicians don't want to uh, admit that economic issues are at, at play with their foreign policy. So they they underplayed this. They never mentioned this publicly. What they insisted was the, the so-called uh, co communist threat. The British, in fact, were quite honest about this. They said they used the bogey of communism uh, to basically uh, persuade people that the, uh, the, the coup was justifiable. But...